Oh, hello. <laughs> Adam C here for Hidden Jackpots. I didn't see you sitting there. I was just reminiscing about that time last week when I was in Toronto, stayed at the Chelsea Hotel, and forgot to do an intro to my room review. Yeah, it happens. You guys want to check out the room review anyway? Hmm. All right, so we just checked into the Chelsea Hotel in Toronto on Girard Street and Young Street. I'm on the 24th floor. Oh, look at that. Why is my door open already? I don't know if that's a good sign or a bad sign, but there's my room. <laughs> Let's take a look. Oh, it's right in here. All right, first thing I walk in, what do I see? Little entrance, the washroom. We will check that out in a second. Let's check out this closet. Well, there we have a safe, which is a good thing. Ironing board, a bunch of hangers, a little luggage rack. I don't see any robes or slippers, which is fine. I do not mind that. Next, we'll go over to the bathroom. It's a little tiny. We got the one sink. Giant mirror. It's a giant mirror. Hello. Oh, and check out the new Blue Jays hat. What do you think of that? Matches my shirt, actually. All right, anyway, enough of that. We got some toiletries here. I'm not sure what brand that is. True Terra. I don't know about that. We got a slip mat there for the bathtub. There's the bathtub and shower combo. It's a regular shower head. Got these. I'm not sure how I feel about these, but I usually bring my own shampoo. Don't need conditioner or anything, but that's a oh, body wash and conditioner. I don't know where the shampoo is. I don't know what's up with that, but it doesn't look too bad. I'll take it. Let's go out into the living quarters here. We've got another mirror. Hello. Ice bucket. And look at this. I love that. Is there anything in it? No. Nice. Sweet. I love a nice empty fridge. Got a lamp over here. Clock. There's no... I don't see any outlets or anything over here. No charging ports. There's the Bible. I'll just close that up real quick. It looks like this is a queen bed, which is also fine. I don't mind a queen bed. Once again, I almost forgot to do the bed test. There's the bed. I think it's queen size. Let's see if it passes the test. Is that a good bed test? Maybe I'll try a different one. That was better, and it passes the bed test. Got the TV there, the stand. It's got some empty drawers here. Yeah, plenty of drawer space to keep your clothes. Oh yeah, there's like six drawers in here. I don't have that many clothes. I'm only here for one night. A coffee maker with some disposable cups. Not a coffee maker, a kettle. But there is some coffee there little seating area over here got a little work desk oh and look at that the lamp has two power outlets and a usb port not bad not bad there's two waters which are mine you guys want to see the view from the 24th floor you can kind of see it right here let's open this curtain So there's the view, not too bad. Oh, look at that. Looks like there's a balcony. Is this door open? Come on, let's see. Oh, oh my God, almost fell over. Get out of here. Are you kidding me? 24th floor and I have a balcony? Oh, I'm freaking scared. I don't even know if I can step out here. Look at this. Look at this, I don't, I don't even know. Can I do this? Holy crap. I'm gonna put you guys over the edge because I hate heights. Can you see that? Because I can't. I'm not looking, I'm just gonna watch the video. That is insane.
So yeah, that's the uh, view from up here. And uh, I really can't believe I got a balcony. I'm going to go back inside because this is scaring the crap out of me. Holy crap. Wow. The breeze is nice though. Holy moly. There is the balcony. I'm going to unpack. Whew. Need to compose myself because I'm on the 24th floor and that is just too high. I'm freaking sweating from being out there. All right, that's it. If you like this room review, this room tour, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Hit the bell, hit the subscribe button. I appreciate every one of you watching. And uh, with that, I'm out. Ciao.